Hey everyone, Apocalypse 3. Let's try it on Tanglewood. Maybe we'll be more lucky. Let's hope we don't have the stupid paramike objective. Hey, these objectives are nice actually. Wow. So, I'm not the kind that just starts over and over again just because of the objectives. No, I, I'll try to do what I get, right? So yeah, again, setting up takes more time than the one itself. Oh, and by the way, if you play on Apocalypse, you can use those as light source. You can also use the dots. They work as a light source, but the flashlight doesn't work. But uh, the headgear works too. So you get at least some light sources. And of course the lanterns, it won't attract the ghost, uh, the glow sticks. They won't attract the ghost neither. I recommend you to have both EMF in case it's a wraith or a phantom. And for the objective, the thermal to find where the ghost room is, a camera because you need a ghost photo. And of course, uh, the crucifixes, they are very important. And these items, yeah, they are all, and all the lanterns as a light source. So, oh my god, it's not as long as Ridge View, unfortunately, it's not a long road to walk but still it takes some time so i'll be back in two hours <sighs> oh my god this time it took five minutes i think but uh, it's like an eternity to set up everything so like i said use the lanterns as a light source you can toss them in there and you can scatter them around also you can test right away for on wheel if it tries to hunt right on top of you and uses the crucifix here you go, there are the crucifixes. Secure this area. Come on, unbuck, please. <gasps> it's here, damn. <gasps> oh my god, the ghost is here. Damn it. I'm scared. The breaker box? Wait. It's in uh It's in the garage, I think. Why you? Well, you can test if it's still hunting by using um the thing, the flashlight, uh, the lights of the building. It didn't come this way. It's in the garage. You hear that? runs to the basement it's so fast I think this is faster than normal 150% speed Actually, let's put this here so we know when the ghost is approaching. Um, that's because of the lanterns.
wait, it sounds way slower now. Is it twins? Or is it a mimic? <sighs> it's difficult. It sounds way slower now than before. Before it was so damn fast and now it's way slower. I have to get my last smudge, please. It's not a demon because um, it's not an Oni, okay. I can place this here so we can hear the doors. I have to step into my sensors, my friend. Let's mark that hiding spot. Was that a true interaction? I'm too scared to get out because of that. Yeah, it's faster again. You hear that? I think it's twins. It's here. It's here. It's here. It's coming. The sensors. Whoa, it was right next to me. It's so scary, guys. Seriously, this is so scary. But it's in the same room this whole time. That's a bit weird. can listen for two interactions between the hunts. It stays in the garage though. You hear that? It's slower again. Way slower. It's either the Mimic or the Twins. I have to smudge it though. It's here. It's in here. Oh my god, did it see me? No, it didn't see me. It wasn't here. So now we get some time. Because I've smudged it. Show yourself. Show yourself. Are you here? Show yourself. I need a ghost photo. I don't have a smudge with me. I'm totally insane. I might die here. Because if it comes this way again, I'm dead. Thank you! There's a crucifix here. You can't hunt from here. Forget about that, mister. I think it's only a two star. No, it's a three star. Wow, I just need the bone. I could get the perfect game here, but let's not let's not become greedy. I think we are dealing with the twins here, but we have to repel it. You can listen for two interactions. It can't hunt from here because there are crucifixes here. It's within range, it should sense me. It should come here. Just oh damn it, here it comes. did it where's the bone give me the bone please and we can leave please give it to me is it right here somewhere i can move this a bit further maybe it's gonna prevent the ghost from hunting i don't know if this hiding spot here works damn it the bone is not here 
If it's in the basement or something like that, I won't be able to do that. No, I don't see it here. What's that? No, that's not the bone. No, that's too risky. I'm gonna leave. That might have been another twin interaction. Let me out. What I can do, it's cheesy, but I can check the garage from outside <laughs> for all these. But you can't do that on Sunny Meadows. You can only check the entrance hall and there's a camera anyways. So I only see weird rain. <clears throat> I don't see any Orbeez or something. Oh, that's... Huh? Oh, that's the garage, yeah. That's uh, the shelf in there. No, I don't I don't think it's a mimic. There were some weird speed changes, but I think it's the twins because I don't know why somehow the twins are easier to identify um, using their speed on 150% speed. And I still got one smudge, hey! Woo, that was tough. So if you wanna do that untangle what you can hide in the first room, you can set up your base there. We have been lucky that the ghost didn't change room. Let's see, was it white? It was the twins! Oh my god, I survived that, I can't believe it. Imagine a perfect game here. Imagine I would have found the bone. Oh my god, I... I don't know how much money that would be. Oh my god! Look at that payout! That's insane! Apocalypse is insane! And that was a small map on Sunny Meadows. Doing this on Sunny Meadows? Wow, <laughs> it would be... Wow. And imagine having the perfect investigation bonus. It would be about 6k? Or 6.5? I don't know. Wow, that's incredible. Imagine doing this on uh, after prestiging, but it would be insane, you know? You don't have motion sensors, you don't have any light sources, you don't have crucifixes, you don't have smudges, you need a lot of luck to actually do that on like uh, when you've just prestige and you don't have anything, you only have uh, crappy items. Oh my god, imagine that. That's a whole level! Oh my god, that's insane! Five to interactions. I thought I've heard one when there was that weird stuff going on in the kitchen, but I wasn't 100% sure. We had two events. Ah, yeah, we had one airball and then that other event when I've taken the photo. So this is basically what you gotta do. Oh, master bedroom. I was so close to it. I was so close. I had one smudge left. I could have gotten the bone, but I don't know. You saw how, how slow I was, you know? <laughs> So I didn't want to go any further than the living room <laughs> or the foyer. But this is basically what you gotta do. You don't have to take all the photos. Screw that. You only need that one ghost photo. That's important for the Apocalypse Trophy. And you need all the objectives. So if you have these objectives, perfect. They are easy. The motion sensor, you can place it anywhere and just eventually the ghost will run through it even on sunny meadows you just have to be patient and you need a bit of luck of course depending on where the ghost is also roaming and changing ghost room is set to high on this difficulty so you might have a high chance that the ghost eventually is gonna be near that sensor even if you place it near the entrance otherwise it's gonna eventually walk through it during the hunt and yeah but of course you have to do it on solo on sunny meadows um there are some videos uh, where I play this so if you want I'm so fast again oh. if you want this golden trophy yeah you have to do this on sunny meadows and solo you can do some training with friends together on this difficulty but you won't get it if you do it on multiplayer so you have to play it solo so if you want to try it good luck and see you in the next one bye